Springbok hooker Chelly Boy Rallapella, along with Salaki Sports and Leisure, recently hosted a rugby coaching clinic at Ebenezer High School for the kids from the Mokapani region. Salaki Sports and Leisure uh, arranged and organized and uh, drove this day for the kids today. Uh, purely because we are a sports apparel, sports equipment company that, that loves rugby. And um, we saw an opportunity uh, with uh, Chile, who comes from the province, to bring him here. I mean, this has been a two years uh, project that we're trying to put together. We've got seven other ev events we're going to do with the kids on this in this province. And uh, we, we, we've, we're pretty proud that we've got uh, a lot of the younger kids involved in this event because this school, uh, believe it or not, is the only school in this whole township that's got a rugby field. So all of the schools around here rely on the school. Today it's just uh, chilly to come and motivate the kids and have a bit of a, a run around a rugby clinic. But the motivation was a key part for the kids to tell them that I come from humble be beginnings like you guys. And to, to obviously sh to show them that uh, it can be achieved uh, through whatever. But uh, um, no matter what color or creed you are, uh, what, what, what background you come from, it doesn't really matter. So that's the initial plan of the day. But the important part now is for the kids to get a warm up with them, get a feel of the ball with them, to run around with them and just see him do things. And maybe that will rub on th onto them. It's basically what we're looking at is this developing rugby and broadening rugby spectrum all across the borders of South Africa. And I thought I, I don't think of a much better place than uh, my place of roots where I come from. And, and I thought that uh, this will be a great initiative to, to start here from my roots. And that, that means it's great. It's been great today. It's been a really spectacular day. I mean, the welcoming was overwhelming and very humbling. And I mean, I think I still believe there's, there's so much talent out here. It's, it's a matter of just nursing it and just giving them the right right, uh, right tools that they need uh, to further up with their talent or their sport. Being a role model for these kids, it's important that we get so, uh, many more role, role models taking part in such uh, initiatives, such clinics and stuff to, in order to, to inspire and, and also it's for them to be able to see that yes, here's a guy from also humbling beginnings and from similar humbling beginnings as us uh, that made it and why can't we also make so it gives them that extra drive that they need, that hope that they need in order for them to succeed. Basically what we start off with is just uh, basic uh, handling and uh, just gave them one or two agility workout and and looking at their working out their tackling technique and also their clean out techniques because those I believe are the most important things on the rugby field. That if, you, if you can't tackle, you can't play rugby. If you can't pass, you can't play rugby. And if you're not agile enough to move around, you're also going to have a long day or <laughs> you're going to have a long working day in the office. So it's important that we we get these basic elements into place and for them to understand why we're trying to achieve this thing is also important. You never know how good you are until you've tried. Come on, let's play. The case